The start of this year was like no other, the chatter about what the season was going to be. Every single guiding friend I knew was talking about it being a big fish year. Nobody had ever seen fish of, of that build and that, that, that condition. There were some huts and we called in just to see the hut and in the log book every single tourist was complaining of no sleep and mice running across their faces. So. It's hard to put this season into words actually. It's, um, I'd consider this probably one of the best seasons for large fish that I've ever seen. It was pretty early on I realised this is going to be pretty special. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity. It's never going to happen again. The type of fishing that was happening at that moment, it was just blowing minds all around the world, the, the fish that came out. Watch it! Left! <laughs> That's a double! We knew that going into the season, and we were going to go hard to make the most of every opportunity. I just had mission after mission that I just had the most incredible days, experiences, and come home and focus on the next mission ahead. He's coming! He's eating it! Well, you told me about a critter fly, and he was there. He just came up, cool as you like, and sucked it in. Oh, hey! Oh, this is heavy. <laughs> heavy old boy, all right, man. He's a brute, this one. He's got a big head. All right. Right down there. They're always on the same spot. Oh, he's in. Oh, baby, baby! Give me some. I think this is a kingy, boys, unless it's a big tree. If it's a giraffe, I want to see it. If it's a kingy, I want to see it. <laughs> oh, how good is it, though, when you're casting a fish Man. that you can see and they're taking your flies? <laughs> Man, they wear you out during the fight and after the fight. It's a heavy fish. Oh, well, nice. Oh, you must be stuck. <laughs> I'm over the moon. <laughs> what a start. And this dawn. It's giving you the run around. <laughs> <laughs> Suck! <Yes. laughs> On a white rock, that's a fish, eh? Yeah, well done. Yeah, that's a, that's a seriously big fish. He knows exactly how to get rid of that hook. That's a smart old fish. Hey! <laughs> Look at that. Condition factor, man. That is a f***ing movie dick. There you go, Craig. Double hook up. <laughs> Look at the size of yours. <laughs> Beast. Big jack. So mine's a hand and yours is a jack. Yeah. I don't know. Go, Shana, go. Big fish. A big fish. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> he's huge. Dude, he's like, he's huge. Hannah, that's such a great fish. I reckon we should end it here and go get some dinner. Yeah, pull it. I can finish off those bottles of wine. Fishing with friends is how you live life. You know, and it's, no matter how good you think you are, you're still going to get your butt kicked. Um, but if you get in there and, and give plenty and keep your head down and keep working, you'll get them. This season seemed like a biblical story. Everything from plagues to pandemics. 100 year floods to lockdowns, there is no way anyone could have predicted how this was going to play out. And the whole world stopped so fast. So I think the virus almost ironically came at a time where it sort of saved that fishery that year. The one thing lockdown did give us is time to think and reflect on the season that's been and the fact that we live in arguably the world's best fly fishing playground. <laughs>